Brother Roop here. We are making another exciting video about our hero, the Apostle Paul, Luke, and a bunch of other people in their entourage. And they had just uh, come into Anatoke. This is verse 14 of the chapter 13 of the book of Acts. That is Acts chapter 13, verse 14. They had, uh, earlier in the chapter, they had gone throughout uh, Cyprus and preached the gospel, even to the proconsul of the island. And then they set sail uh, from Paphos to Pergi, Perga, which was a seaport. And uh, verse 14, I'll read verse 14. And when they departed from Perga, they came to Anatoke and Presidia, and went into the synagogue on the Sabbath day and sat down. So, they are moving along. Apostle Paul's moving along. Um, they're in Anatoke and Presidia. Now, that's don't confuse that with Anatoke in Syria. That's where the church had, had a large revival among the Gentiles. And um, uh, so that was a whole different city there. That was a, a large, important city in Syria. Anatoke and Presidia is a different city. It's in Presidia. It's in Asia Minor. So there's two different cities here. Uh, Presidia was a province in Asia Minor, and uh, it's north of Pamphylia, uh, the city of Antioch was not in Presidia, but within the limits of Pergia. But it, but politically, it belonged to Presidia. It was part of Presidia's uh, uh, political reach. They politically ruled the city, even though it was in a different province. So, you know, a lot of atheists will say, hey, look at this, look at this, this is wrong, the Bible's wrong, this is not the Word of God, da 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 da, here's an error. No, it's not an error. You know, a lot of atheists like to study the Bible just to find errors. <laughs> so they actually, a lot of them actually read the Bible more than Christians do. So, but no, it's not an error. They, you know, the city, you know, was politically in their political control, even though it was in their province, territorial province. And that's not unusual in the course of human history. Politics gets kind of weird. So, <laughs> so. <laughs> um, and it was, it's generally referred to as uh, Anatoka Presidia to distinguish it from Anatoka in Syria, which I just said. And, uh, uh, you know, the city was built by uh, Seleucus, the founder of the Anatoke in Syria. So, founded by the same guy. It was called after the name of the fa of his father, Anatotius. He is said to have built 16 cities of the same name. And that could get a little confusing. Um... Paul went to the synagogue. As soon as he got to the town, it was Saturday, so he went to the synagogue. Um, even though Paul and Barnabas were on a special mission to the Gentiles, they uh, they went every opportunity to preach the gospel to the Jews first. Uh, once the Jews rejected them in the town, then they would go to the Gentiles. And it was pretty common for the Gentiles to... Uh, be more receptive than the Jews were to the gospel. So, so that's why they went to the town and they meet, I guess they got to the town on Saturday from the text. It looks like they got to the town on Saturday. And uh, so he immediately went to the synagogue and sat in to preach Jesus in the synagogue. So they were moving along, moving from town to town, preaching. Paul is preaching. Paul and Barnas, Barnas with them. 
and preaching to all these different towns. And um, later on in life, years later, they're going to return and re-preach and, uh, and, 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 and encourage the churches that grew up from their first original uh, evangelistic tour. They start little churches. They put pastors in charge, and those churches grow. Then years later, Paul will go back. And we'll see. Paul will go back and uh, strengthen those churches. So he's Paul and Barnabas making a good team here, preaching team, evangelistic team, doing a good job and starting lots of churches, and uh, they are moving along, doing God's work. Amen. Thank you.